everybody. I'm standing in my laundry room. I feel like I'm getting ready to do a commercial, <laughs> but I thought today's video would be fun just to show you some things that I'm just loving. Today's Valentine's Day, so it's all about love, right? So I just wanted to share one little thing, uh, a product that I have found recently that I really do love. I don't know about you, but sometimes you get overwhelmed with all of the uh, brands and the scents and the, all the varieties of laundry detergent but recently I came across this stuff is Arm & Hammer plus OxyClean and it says that it has a fresh scent um, aroma fresco whatever that means but it really does make my laundry just smell really really good and I mean even after the sheets are on the bed I could tell a difference in the guest room when I was sitting in there having my devotions this morning I'm like that stuff smells so good so I just thought if it was a recommendation from me that you might like to try it and you know, I think it helps to know if somebody else has had good success with something. I always like getting a recommendation from someone else. So, hey, this is good stuff. Give it a try. Here's another thing that I really am so thankful that I found, and that is a recipe for my own taco seasoning. I also love these little jars. I found these at TJ Maxx. They come in a set, I think, of four. But um, you can control the amount of salt that you put into it and even how spicy you like it. And so I just keep that recipe handy, and when this little jar gets empty, I just fill it back up again. And then I use about two tablespoons um, for each recipe of tacos that I make and I'm right here got a pan of uh, beef browned and ready for the seasoning to go on it but I love this if you haven't tried this recipe it is on my blog down in the section where it's like um, extra things to, uh, marinades and that kind of thing but I'll put a link here to it as well but I love this This is a battery operated milk frother. You stick it down inside your cup for about 10 to 20 seconds. It doubles the volume of your cream. Then you pour in your coffee and look at this glorious result. Love this thing. So another little idea that I want to share with you is something that I learned about just this week as I was listening to Revive Our Hearts broadcast. I heard a man telling about taking a notebook, and I'm going to use just a tiny one like this. This is one of these little small composition notebooks inside of here. And every day he would write something to his wife about maybe a character trait that he saw in her that day or something that she did that he wanted to remember and he wrote it in this book and he did it from one Christmas to the next and so he gave it as a Christmas gift well today as I said is Valentine's Day so I've started my book today Shh, don't tell my husband I started it today and I began by saying this is a book of, re of thankfulness for the man that you are begun on February the 14th 2018 and every day I'm just gonna write just a little segment of something I've just got like something sweet he did for me he brought me breakfast this morning and I just want to record those things in my little notebook and it might just be you know just a sentence or two and then by the end of the year for next Valentine's Day, I want to have a really special little book to be able to give to him. So that might be something that you would want to do and start for your Valentine or your sweetheart for his birthday or an anniversary, whatever. I thought it was a great idea. And it will also be, you know, a, like a journal of remembrance uh, of all the things that you've done that year. So there's another little idea. Get your little notebook and start writing down some things that will encourage your husband about what you saw in him. So another little idea that I have for you that it's been a blessing to me for the last probably, I don't know, 10 years or so is right here, this little silver ball. 
This is called a friendship ball. And what happens is there's a little latch um, on it and the ball actually opens up and you can put something inside. It's a small something, but what you do is you, you find a gift to put inside of it and then you pass it along to somebody else. Now, for the use that we've had is just within our family. My mom and my two sisters and I, and maybe one of the daughter, some of the daughters-in-law have had, had it as well, but I know for sure it's been um, my mom and my two sisters and myself. And you just find a little something. It might be a necklace, it might be a hanky, just some kind of little treasure. My sister gave it to me recently that had, had some of the Mary Kay um, lip scrub and lip balm inside of it. So it just doesn't have to be something, you know, expensive even, just a small something. And so I keep it until I go back to visit with one of my family members. I put another gift in it and I pass it along to somebody else. And the idea is to keep it rotating. You don't keep it for six months, but um, keep a gift in it and keep it moving. I think it's a fun idea to do in a family, but uh, obviously you could also do it with a group of friends and just keep it within a small circle so you don't lose track of it. But it's just a really special idea and a fun way to let somebody know that you're thinking about them and that you do love them. And what better place to do it in a family? Kind of keeps the love going. You might try that.